today's vlog. Just picked up my coffee. And we're about to run to Kohl's in the mall area. Um, still looking for a couple last minute things for Christmas. And I had some Kohl's cash to spend, so I bought, well, I didn't really buy myself a pair of earrings, but I, Kohl's gifted it to me through Influencer, which is an influencer program online um, that I do. I basically review things in exchange for goods, and I highly recommend you guys join, by the way. I have a code if you want to sign up using my code because it gives both of us credit. It's really awesome. Um, but yeah, so I ordered myself a pair of rose gold earrings with um, cubic cubic zircona I think is how you say it the like crystals or whatever are cubic zircona and I'm gonna go pick those up and I think walk around the mall area a little bit because I still have one gift to buy and I just haven't found it yet and yeah um we might end up going to Ulta I'm not quite sure if I'll have time with Nate He's in a really good mood now, but he's um, been having a day. Like, it's it's been a rough day because I think he's been having gas. So, that's what the plan is. We'll see if it works because if, nay, if not, it's all good. There's Tomorrow's the weekend, so it's going to work out either way. So, let's go. I would do an Ulta haul for you guys. So these, first of all, these are the earrings that I picked up from Kohl's. I'll get closer so you can see them better. They're really simple and I like that a lot. They're um, rose gold, 18 karat rose gold plated over sterling silver and they have cubic, cubic zircona. I think I said it right that time. So, So I was out of concealer and in one of my more recent vlogs, I guess, actually it wasn't recent, it was like maybe a month or two ago, um, I tried out this Makeup Revolution Conceal and Define Full Coverage Conceal and Contour. Um, this is what it looks like. And it's just a concealer and I got the shade C1. Um, I like this decently it's seven dollars first of all so i like the price point the most um i used to use sh uh tarte shape tape more often than any other concealer but it's just really expensive and i go through it really fast um so because i'm not overly pressed about what kind of concealer i get like i'm not, i like makeup but i don't like makeup like that much um so this is a good option. It's not as, it's not as high coverage, but it's a good like consistency. It kind of melts into your skin and I appreciate that. So I repurchased this. I picked up this uh, Makeup Revolution Fast Base Stick Foundation. So you open it up in the middle like that and then it like screws up like it's a, um, lipstick but it's this tube's obviously much bigger than a lipstick um and this was only nine dollars at ulta which is pretty awesome and oh i'll um link everything below for you guys so like in case you see something that you think you might like to try i'll link below for you guys um but i haven't ever tried this yet um this is gonna be my first time using it but 
I swatched it in the store and it felt really creamy and that's kind of what I'm going for because ever since I had Nate, my skin's gotten pretty dry. The next thing I got was I just picked up this Ulta Beauty Brush and Sponge Cleanser. It's the 1.7 fluid ounces one, 50 milliliters. Just simple little brush cleanser. Um, yeah. It's e.l.f. Ultra Precise Brow Pencil in the color Neutral Brown. And this was $5, so um, I'm getting my eyebrows done tomorrow. So I have never really been good about doing my own eyebrows before, but I'm going to start trying because I'm getting actually like my eyebrows are getting really sparse right here, just probably part of my um, postpartum uh, hair loss situation that's going on. I'm also balding right here. It's really lovely. Um, so I figured I'd start trying to fill them in like a little bit right here. That's not where I get them waxed either. Like my hair's just kind of falling out. So I usually just get them waxed here and then on top and then in the middle. Following e.l.f. here. I got this makeup mist and set and it says clear I don't know why it says clear because it's just a facial mist like of course it's clear but it's that one and it's just a spray bottle and it's supposed to just make your uh, makeup stay in place all day helps prevent colors from running or fading together it has aloe green tea cucumber vitamins a c and e so it sounds like it's pretty good for your skin and of course, e.l.f. is um, no animal testing and this product is vegan. And last but not least, this is the splurge. This, all of, like, all that stuff was um, drugstore makeup. This is the splurge here. <laughs> because this is my most favorite mascara on the planet. And of course it's vegan because I only use vegan makeup, but... <sighs> Guys, this mascara is $24. I know it's expensive but um it's amazing this is my most favorite mascara ever it makes my eyelashes look like they're false eyelashes so it's great they had this limited edition one so i got it because first of all i opened it up i'm like well the packaging alone that's cute right it's like glittery i don't know if you can see it it has glitter on it so you open it up though and this is what got me And it has like all these crystals. It's so cute. This is what the wand looks like. In case you're interested. This is um, a bristle wand, I think is what you call it. So. It's really good. I love this mascara. I thank you all for watching. And I will see you tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 4. Bye.